in an old house in Paris that was covered with vines lived 12 little girls in two straight lines. They left the house at half past nine in two straight lines. Or shine. The smallest one was Madeline. There comes the aeroplane from America. The girls were excited. They all had goose pimples because their guest was the Hollywood star, Sugar Dimples. Sugar has a costume fitting for her new movie, but it isn't till this afternoon. <laughs> they toured around Paris for over an hour. The Champs Elysees to the tall Eiffel Tower. But Sugar was acting a tiny bit sour. <gasps> Maybe she is hungry. Me oui, Danielle. Lunch will make her more agreeable. The food only deepened Sugar's discontent. Mmm, <laughs> hamburger. Voila! My quiz de grenouille. The finest frog legs in Paris. Sugar, monsieur. She just misses her home. Do you not remember how you felt on your trips abroad? How you missed Genevieve? And the old house? That gives me an idea. I know just how to cheer Sugar up. <laughs> Qu'est-ce que c'est, Sugar? Are you homesick? Mommy was supposed to come with me. Then at the last minute... She had to go to London. <laughs> I miss her so. I'm sorry. You've all been so nice to me. Here, no frogs in this chocolate eclair. I promise. Hmm, it does taste good. But I miss Mommy's Halloween cupcakes. Halloween? Yes, que say. Is that a holiday? You don't have Halloween in France? Be a goblin if you dare. Paint your face all green. Be a ghost and give a scare. Boom, it's Halloween. Carve a pumpkin in the night. What a spooky scene. jack o lantern shining bright. Boom, it's Halloween. Trick or treat, dressed as witch or queen. Bags of candy, oh so sweet. Boo, it's Halloween. Like fun, especially, especially the, the trick or ticking. Oh, 
Oh, yes! You would love it! There you are, sugar. We are late for our costume appointment. Hurry! They went to a shop that had costumes galore, where Sugar was fitted in a crisp pinafore. Amidst harlequins, witches, and a large dinosaur. Monsieur, your head! Merci. Just how to make Sugar's own sickness go away. That night in the old house, a brand new routine as the twelve girls prepared a true French Halloween. Here is Pepito, and here is his chapeau. Huh? Hold still, Pepito. Much excitement they took to the street in hopes of collecting some sweet things to eat. But the French were confused when they heard. Trick or treat! Trick or treat! Trick! Why, you little monster! Sugar was crying. There were many tears, and the loud sound of thunder did not help her fears. I want to go home tonight. <laughs> there, there, ma chérie. Let us have a hot cup of cocoa. But the steamy hot cocoa did not do the trick. For the young Sugar Dimples, so very homesick. So Miss Clavel needed to do something quick. Hello? Madame Dimples? Oui, this is Miss Clavel in Paris. Sugar! Mommy? Oh, Mommy, it is you! I miss you so! And Halloween is coming. But it is so nice to talk to you. The chat with her mother made Sugar quite cheerful. Then Miss Clavel had a plan to make her less tearful. Oh, we are. Oh, yes. Oh, and then. While the girls tried to listen and pick up an earful. There you are, mes petites. Bien, Monsieur Fleming has just arrived. I have the address of the castle we're using for our new film. It's in the Loire Valley. Would you like to come along? Mais oui. Pepito, do? Pepito? Oh, uh, certainly. Uh, certainly. Yeah! They packed up and left without too much hassle and set out in search of a beautiful castle. That's not the one. Too short. Ah! No, too tall. Hmm. No, too ugly. Perhaps this is the one. No, too dirty. Here it is, kids. <gasps> too, too scary! scary. Ah! 
everyone out. I have an important errand to do in town. I'll meet you back here soon. Go ahead. Wait for me in there. I'm sure it is uh, warm and cozy inside. Vite, vite, mes chéris. Hurry! 